we have arrived in Ninh Binh, a province about two hours south of Hanoi in northern Vietnam, known as Ha Long Bay on land due to its surrounding limestone mountains. We're staying in a small town called Tam Kok and I'm super excited to explore over the next few days. hired a paddle boat to take us out to explore Tam Kok by water. Tam Kok literally translates as three caves, referring to the three caves along this stretch of river and we're going to see them all today. What's really unique about the paddle boats here is they paddle with their feet instead of their hands because apparently it creates a much smoother ride. Now we're coming through the limestone cliffs and you can see why it's referred to as Ha Long Bay on land. As we left the town of Tam Kok behind, the busy waterways gave way to a peaceful river that meandered through the rice fields of the surrounding countryside. Enormous limestone cliffs towered above us as we drifted down the river towards the first of the three caves. Okay, we're now approaching our first cave. There's a bit of a crack between the top of the cave and the water and the boat's gonna be going right through it. Whoa, this is so cool. Second cave coming up, this one it's quite a bit shorter than the first one. We can already see the other side. Oh, it's nice to get some shade as well. It's pretty hot out today. So we just passed through the second cave and now the final cave is coming up in front of us. And these are the three caves that Tam Kok is named after. Mind your head in this one. So after rowing about 45 minutes in one direction, we're now heading back to where we started. It's very relaxing. And these landscapes are incredible. We're now back in Tam Kok and it is hot today. So we've come to a restaurant that does some of the cheapest beers that I've ever seen. So 12,000 dong works out at about 40p. So cheapest beer I've ever had. So yesterday when we did the boat tour of Tam Kok, we saw this mountain with a stone dragon on top of it. And you can actually climb up to the top of this and there's an amazing viewpoint at the top with views out across Tam Kok and Ninh Binh. So that's what we're gonna go and do today. It's about a 15 minute drive from the center of Tam Kok to the starting point. 
So we're gonna hop in a taxi now to take us there. So we've just arrived at the base of Hung Mua and there is this massive lotus flower lake. Up there is the dragon statue. So we're gonna be climbing up 500 steps to the top. We just paid 100,000 dong each for entrance to Hung Mua and that includes access to the cave as well as climbing to the top of the viewpoint. Whew, it is getting hotter and hotter though. <laughs> 500 steps to the top. I'll see you in about 15 minutes when I'm sure I will be way sweatier. So this is where we came on the boat yesterday, along this river here. Apparently it's quite rare for the skies to be this clear, which is why it's feeling so hot at the moment. There are no clouds to block the sun at all. I think it's around 35 degrees today. 37. <sighs> No wonder I'm struggling. <laughs> We've made it to the top, and as predicted, I am dripping with sweat. But the view is so good from up here. You can see all the limestone mountains. You've got the rice terraces stretching out into the distance. You've got the lotus garden down there and you can see the river that we came through yesterday. Such an amazing view. Definitely worth the 15 minute sweaty hike up here. We're just wandering around to get a closer look at the dragon. There it is there. We've now left Ninh Binh and made our way to Da Nang in central Vietnam. So that is the end of our time in the north. I really hope you've enjoyed watching this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And I will see you in the next one. We are now in the beautiful city of Hoi An in central Vietnam. This is a lot of people's favorite place in all of Vietnam. So we wanted to spend a few days here and explore as much as we can. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I don't really know what's going on, it's all gone a bit crazy. <laughs>